thank you for tuning in it's been a while since I've uh, uploaded a video January I think and this time I just uh, in my own experience just like to give a bit of a warning if you suffer or have depression you know bipolar there's many ways of saying it. well just basically in my case just a genuine case of the blues depression and you're in the middle if you're thinking about commissioning a fursuit or if you already have commissioned a fursuit but in my case I already have commissioned the first this actual fursuit right now not the most dashing example of a fursuit but uh, it's a heads ahead I mean I do have a full suit but uh, I uh, commissioned this in uh, 2014 and uh, at that moment I was full of energy I was I was up for it I'll turn that down not sure if you can hear my voice and uh, yeah I commissioned this on Fur Furry Taylor she's still she's still quite active now she's I got this fairly cheap but you know that that's a whole other story as I said I'm more of a winter guy I commissioned this I think it was February 2014 I was up for it, I felt like, uh, yeah, I want to be a, I want to get a fur suit, I want to go to the fur meet, so I want to eventually go to a fur week, well, con fuzzled, you know, a furry con, and uh, yeah, I was very contented, I was very sure it was what I wanted, and uh, yeah, towards, uh, the summer I'm actually more of a winter person in the summer I tend that's when I tend to go down I mean I know it's vice versa I mean winter is when you, you get a case of the you know you, you feel a bit down in the dumps the, the weather's the weather plays a part on your moods dampens your spirits but I actually prefer the winter I just prefer like when it gets dark early I like to go for a walk and listen to my iPod and I just you know, I just enjoy, you know, darker nights, it's just, I don't know why, really. And, uh, in the summer, around about June, that's when I first started to feel down my type of depression I've got at the, t over the time. It was, it was largely to do with me low self-esteem. I have low self-esteem issues. Uh, I don't think I'm, like, I don't know, really. I, I don't think I'm very particularly bright. I'm not academically bright, uh, uh, I've always really worked in manual labour and I just kind of thought at least for you know, the so-called furries, these people I want to get to, you know, so-called future friends, they'd look down on me, they'd be snooty, they'd, I don't know, I'm not really that much of a nerd, I mean, uh, I just assume furries are nerd, furries and nerds alike, all that type of thing. A lot more confident, flamboyant, have a lot more charisma than me. I just seemed at the time, summer, it's me, I don't know what was wrong. It's my brain, I don't know what it is. Something I do with me psychological clock. I, I used to get quite tearful. I just used to think, I'm in over my head, what am I doing? I'm so damn stupid, I'm so foolish, I can't do this. I'm I'm not a furry, I'm not a fursuiter, I'm not worthy enough. I'm I'm too stupid to be a furry. <laughs> I'd just be uh well I, I live in a small coastal town so there's not many furries where I live. If they are I I, I, I don't know, I've, I've not bothered to get on Furry Amino and find out or whatever apps. Social websites. Yeah, it was around about June, I cancelled my fursuit. I cancelled it, I felt very humiliated, very stupid, I felt like I waste Furry Taylor's time, but she was cool with it, she says, oh alright then fair enough, I hope everything works out for you, she was cool, she, she, 
I said of course keep the deposit money that I, I paid so much, paid half and uh, yeah and that was it, I thought I was never I will not be wearing this right now I thought I'd just I don't know when it yeah it went on holiday at Blackpool that year that kind of pined me up with me me mum and dad of course I don't really go on holiday anywhere on my own but yeah uh, well I go camping with a mate a buddy of mine but that's that's a whole other story subject I uh I felt very defeated uh, all that but when uh, it got towards September, October I kind of I don't know, I, I had a look I had a look on a, the maker's website, Fairy Taylor and, and uh, I'm, I'm hoping uh, she doesn't mind me using her name on here and uh, this is photographs of how it turned out full, yeah, it's, as I say, it came with a full suit Back, <laughs> back there. I'll have to. I don't know. It's split, but yeah, I've got it repaired and that. But yeah, uh, I saw it. I, I had a good long stare at it, and I just thought it was. She actually, she was selling it on a fur buy, you know, the web, trading website, and I thought something like a bulb went off in my head it was it was towards uh, the end of the year I mean I know everyone's a bit of a you could say a lot of people are humbugs but I don't exactly like that time of year because it's Christmas I just enjoy cooler weather I just I think too much heat just messes with my head <laughs> I don't know what it is there's loads of people all enjoying themselves and acting all rowdy and you know getting into fights you know, in summer people are staying out longer and all that and I just shy away, I don't like that type of atmosphere I know it's all year round, I mean people, I mean Christmas dudes, you know people go out and it doesn't matter what time of year it is, people always go out etc as I say I'm a bit of a social phobe, I'm not as bad now but, uh, yeah I'm babbling a bit I recommissioned my current fursuit and uh, hold on, I'll just get another track on. Sorry about that. Yeah, Locust Toy Box. <laughs> Thought it'd fit the theme. I, uh, yeah, this uh, we commissioned my first suit. And like quite soon I'd paid the rest of what I owed. She kind of reduced it but I just suggested to give her a 20 pound tip. <laughs> I can't remember what the price was and that was around about, it was actually just before bonfire night. It was in November. Uh, I just came, I just shortly came back from a holiday in Holland and uh, Waterdown so that's a bit of an interesting take. And I remember when this uh, suit arrived and all its glory, I was watching, at the time I was watching a Korean film, you know, with the subtitle. The kind of delivery guy dropped it off and all that, and uh, yeah, I do have this uh, suit now, but I'm just saying, if you do have any elements of depression, if you're not feeling up for it, if you just feel like you've just lost faith in yourself, uh, you just have, I mean, you might want to put commission in a fursuit on hold, but you want to get your slot, don't you? Or just say, I need a bit of time, don't cancel it, I just need time, I need time to think. Can you put it on a backbone and give yourself a break from it, whoever your maker is at the top, or whoever. And uh, just say, uh, I just need time to think, I'm not feeling myself, I feel a bit low, I'm not. I just need to 
have a bit of a soul search to make sure that uh, per, you know getting a fur suit is what you want but I don't I mean I was quite lucky really I mean I don't do what I do don't commission a fur suit and then feel so down that you don't want to you just cancel it and then you feel like a monumental failure when you do that you feel I'm not good enough to be a furry I'm fucking pathetic I'm pathetic I'm pitiful I'm weak I'm meek fucking jeep you know, like <laughs> I don't know people that live in cities people that travel the world people that drive cars people that work in offices they're the ones that are furry you know like up there you know the gifted smart types or whatever oh there's people that are good at you know the old you know like good at climbing the social ladder you know all that type of thing I, I, I'm not very too honest like yeah now I've not been depressed for a number of years now yeah this helps the Taliprom take one daily 20 milligram uh, to be honest I haven't really been taking these that much because I've been uh, I do have a bit of a drink problem some from time to time it depends if I've had a bad week and uh, yeah when you have a bit have a few bevies you just forget to take it and you wake up around about five in the morning and you just think yeah i'm not taking the tablet though this is entirely different olanzapine that's a mild antipsychotic five milligram i wanted to lower the dosage because uh oh, i'll turn it off now you kind of put weight so if, uh, if i'm not taking this I'm drinking mainly booze, you know, as in beer. Yeah, beer's my poison. I usually drink Neo Lagers and that. Gears, well, it's just... And, uh, so yeah, I've got a bit of a gut, and, and like when I don't drink, I'm taking this fucking thing that <laughs> you gain weight from it, so I can't win, really. Thank you for watching. So, as I say, I've uh, I'm more, I feel more comfortable and at peace, and generally more happy with myself. I do, as I was say, like antipsychotic. I do get paranoid and a bit edgy, but to be honest, I'd rather be paranoid than depressed. Because if you're paranoid, I think it's a type of survival instinct, you know, you're trying to avoid danger or something like that. So I'd rather be like a bit on the old uh, edgy, you know, defensive side and just a complete down, you know, unenergetic bipolar. I've was, I was never, was never been bipolar, just depressed. And, uh, yeah, I think... At the time when I was working at this farm, I, that's a whole other story. I, I used to kind of have fits of like sobbing when I was working there because I, I didn't like who I was working with at the time. That's this voluntary job cutting up Kindlewood. That was in 2014. I've, I've left there. So, so I've been there in years. And uh, yeah. Uh, I can't think of anything left on the subject to cover. Yeah, medication doesn't hurt. There's all different methods. I mean, there's meditation that can, I, yeah, you don't have to take any artificial stuff, you know, pharmacy crap. Yeah, thank you for watching. 
and uh, I like to think there's always a reason to be a bit more upbeat and not have your gloomy days. I mean, I still have my gloomy days. I've not been to the gym in a, a long time. I've, this lack of uh, physical exercise isn't good for your mental health. But yeah, I'm no expert, so. And uh, yeah, uh, not been to the Leeds meet in a while. Yeah, that's, yeah, it's a train journey from here, but hoping to go there soon. And uh, yeah. Cheers, have a blast. So if you don't drink, have yourself a energy drink or white bean or whatever. Or if I rambled.